Welcome back to Streamline Entertainment. It's Marvin speaking. Uh, we're going to get into a private message, um, which is quite interesting. And it says, hi, Marvin. Came across the documentary on YouTube about the Marley boys in the email below. Also, the report I referred um, to it in my last email was commissioned by Waltham Forest, not Waltham Stoke. Um, the Reaches, uh, which was conducted by London South Bank University. I am attaching the report. Um, it is a large um, document, but I've also attached um, a screenshot where the report talks about the links between the Marley boys and cryptocurrency. Ring a bell? Question mark. Isn't that interesting? So we move on. The Marley boys, also known as um, uh, Marley Strip or Mali Strip, are an organised street gang based in Leighton and Walthamstow, East London. Patrickly, the postcodes E10 and E17. They are known to control the rugs trade in the area with violence. In 2019, they um, reported to have around 40 to 50 members who reported uh, to be responsible for hundreds of violent attacks and number of killings leading um, to the gang's reputation for extreme violence. The gang is named after Somali due to many of their founding members being um, of Somali descent. However, the gang is uh, ethnically diverse. Uh, though it's predominantly male. In a report commissioned by the local Waltham Forest Council, the gang was described as the most business-driven, violent and ruthless street gang in Waltham Forest. And like many of the street gangs, the Marley Boys are not active on social media and seek anonymity, uh, though it has been reported uh, they use Facebook to monitor police officials. The gang has connections with other organised crime groups in London and operate county lines drug networks. The gang is involved in criminal child exploitation and grooming of young children. Many smaller local gangs are in alliance uh, or have been um, subsumed, subsumed into the, the Marley boys such as Drive and Marlow, DM Boundary, Copy Mill and Stony Down. In 2018 it was reported that the police sources estimate the gang generate approximately about 50,000 per week from rug sales. Um, some of the history, the Marley boys emerged in 2015 after splintering off um, for the Bowman crew gang. On March the 14th, 2018, Joseph Williams Torres was, um, was shot and killed in Walthamstow, East London by the members of the Marley boy. Joseph Williams Torres had mistakenly been identified as a gang member and was not um, intended target. Prosecutor Alison Hunter QC said the killing was part of a set of related and uh, re artillery re um, um, acts of violence rooted in a dispute uh, between rival groups. In particular, violence had begun to escalate after the Marley Boys member uh, Elijah Donnelly was murdered in 2017. The Marley Boys were reported to be in a turf war with a group known as the Priority Court or Higham Hill, and that's not actually far. Um, the two sort of boroughs. One of the defenders accused of um, murder, uh, Hamzad Ohag, uh, had previously been uh, squirted with acid in November 2017, while another member of the Marley Boys was stabbed by a group of individuals in Walthamstow. In December 2018, Daniel uh, Fokoya, a member of the rival gang Priory Court and two others men, drove a stolen car in uh, Leighton High Street um, territory um, of the Marley Boys. They were armed with a loaded gun, a knife, and uh, amnomnia. Uh, they encountered and chased four members of the Marley Boys until they ran and hid inside an off-license. Daniel was was later sentenced to 15 years in prison for the offence. Oh, wow, it's absolutely crazy. And they're going to be more organised now. I mean, this was, what, five, six years ago this all happened? On 8th of January 2019, 14-year-old, 14, old Jaden Moody was stabbed um, to death in nine times by a group of a Marley Boys member in Leighton, East London. Jaden was associated with rival gang Bowman Crew, also known as Let's Get Rich. And we allegedly out uh, rug dealings of the time of death. Marley Boys members drove into the scooter and, and wow, stabbed him as he lay on the ground. Um, Ayup um, Madulin. Uh, Madge Doolin was sentenced to life in prison with a minimum term of 21 years. This is this is what kind of years they do. 
if he's 18, 19, he's going to miss the crucial time of his life um, between the ages of 20 and 40. And he gets out in 40. Most of his life um, is over. Uh, it's 21 years and 18 months to run c um, concurrently as a result of um, murder. Ayyub um, Madulin has previously been um, identified as a victim of modern slavery by the National Crime crime agency in november 2021 five members of the Mali boys were found guilty of supplying class a uh, rugs to essex wow it just goes on and on and on and on and on it really 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 does and really some really interesting information there um once again thank you for someone who told me to look into this one of the things that strike me the most is how young some of these kids look um some of them are about I've I've heard of like 11, 12, 13, 14 um, of different ethnic minorities from all over. And it's crazy how uh, basically it's getting bigger and bigger and bigger. And I think the government need to really crack down on these zombie knives and using knives and, sh and need to be heavier on sentences as well for the Mali boys, one of the most violent gangs in London. Just last year, the National Crime Agency... Next I did it again. That's small protest, bus case in court. Me up from the active side of late and something got dropped, but we still want more. Me, I got beef with pagans, got a look left and right every time I walk. Forensic suit on a pagan block, that's tense and chalk. Push it all to the limit, no fish, no broski, fill it. You know that my bros are with it, her something got dropped. Good riddance. Niggas want to talk about drillings and killings. Who are you kidding? Gelato twinning. That's your friends. It always seems to me a bit of a game until they actually get caught and they're doing life in prison and their lives passing them by. And the oldies recruiting the youngsters is just awful. And something has really got to be done and about the county lines as well. Let me know what you think, people. But there's some insight. Um, about the Marley boys and it goes a lot deeper than that but some of it you know I can't even show um, on uh, YouTube uh, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and once again thank you all